children. They are all our responsibility. The Yemeni Merchant Association organized the Bronx Youth Peace Congregation in Fordham Plaza. Local organizations and elected officials gathered as young children and teens expressed their concern for the increasing crime rate in the Bronx. Are here today to give a platform for our youth in the Bronx to get the opportunity to share and reflect on how they feel about the rise in uh, violence. Throughout the program, the young representatives took turns expressing their worries about the crime they've experienced. From witnessing bullets fly at a party to losing middle school aged friends, the youth has had enough and are pleading to be heard to ensure their safety. We have to be extremely cautious of what we do, where we're going, stay in groups and stuff like that. And a lot of activities we can't even participate in because of all the violence that's going on in our communities. Bronx District Attorney Darcel Clark was eager to hear the speakers take a stand for themselves, and it allowed her to get a better understanding of what needs to be done to serve the Bronx youth. I want to hear from the kids exactly how it's affecting them, what they need to help them to prevent it from happening to them. Evarista Roman from the Ghetto Brothers urges children and teens to think before they act because acting on impulse could lead to serious repercussions. A lot of us play with guns and we know the consequences of being in jail for many years. And that's not the way you want to live. Looking towards the future, organizations and elected officials are working towards providing more opportunities to keep the youth in safe spaces and out of harm's way. The foundation is opportunity. I got some after school programs, I got some mentorship, I got all of these things that helped me to learn about college, to learn about dance, to learn about all of these different opportunities and see something different for myself and more for myself. And that's what we have to make sure that we're providing for our kids. All those who attended today, promise to do whatever it takes to keep crime low and our children safe. Reporting for BronxNet, Brittany Schuyler-Albain.